guys, it's the next day. Eric and I were exhausted yesterday because we had to wake up early first of all to move all of our suitcases over. We also had a bunch of deliveries and we also had some this morning as well. But we finally have a fridge, a washing machine and then a bunch of Amazon stuff came as well. So we got chairs. My computer table has also arrived. I just have to put it together. I also bought some lights yesterday because actually we don't have lights in the living room and in the second bedroom so it's like really dark um, so we ordered those they should be coming sometime today I spent the morning clearing up and then measuring our windows so I am going to be putting in an order for knittery for our curtains um, I might also buy a box for Hina's toys because it's like really messy right now I also need to buy a sewing machine for Cafe Sheep um, also, oh, storage boxes. I need to do a Muji order. Oh, so many things we need to buy. But the lucky thing is, um, in Japan, things come super quickly. So you can schedule things for the next day. I just ordered lunch on Uber Eats, unfortunately, because we have so many things arriving. I cannot leave the house. Uh, well, look, I can because we do have like a delivery box downstairs. But because we have so much stuff, I just want to be home to receive everything so I can, you know, organize my life. Um, so let's just keep cleaning up and organizing. went to the supermarket to pick up some essentials so I wanted to buy more but we can't buy too much because we don't have any pots and pans so we can't cook and also we don't have much storage in the kitchen yet but I just ordered uh, some cabinets so that should be coming in two days I got some coffee I always got this when I was living in Japan because it's like a hundred yen and it lasts like a week for me so ugh, it's so good and then we just got some fruits, oranges and bananas, some cheese. We got this because, well, okay, I love cheese, but also Hina needs to take these meds every night and she doesn't really like taking, well, she doesn't take them alone. So we usually have to put the med in cheese or like in some treats. So we got this mainly for Hina. Then some rice and then just some kitchen sponges. So for the rest of the night, I'm gonna set up my computer. So we received our tables, we put them together. So our computer area is, well, not done yet, but it's getting there. I was just unpacking my suitcase and I found this. Hina has not taken her worming tablets in like two months. And I just realized, so you're gonna have to take this here, yeah? from this. Speak! Louder! Speak! Softer. Softer. Yes.
So I just took a shower and tried to clean my closet, but then I realized that I couldn't get much done because I needed the smaller drawers, which I was not able to get um, at Muji yesterday because they ran out of stock. But because I can't work on my closet until I order the stuff, I'm gonna do it right now. And it says that the stuff can be delivered on Wednesday. And luckily there is an option where I can um, pay cash when they arrive because for some reason my credit card is not working with Muji. <laughs> it's the next day and I thought I would end this video by letting you guys know how I feel about this apartment so as you guys probably already figured I love this apartment I feel like it was meant to be the other apartments we were interested in and wanted to apply for unfortunately in Japan it's first come first serve we were hesitant to apply for this one because I haven't even seen it in person yet when we applied but it just worked out so well and the area is absolutely lovely I've been walking here now every single day and taking different streets, exploring the area. I absolutely love it and people are so friendly around here. So I met some of our neighbours and every time they see Hina, they're so happy to give her pats. The building manager also met Hina on the first day, was giving her lots of pats and everyone that has met her has said that she's just a very calm dog. So yeah, she's been loving that. We've been busy finding furniture. Um, we've just been buying everything online. So most of our furniture either came from Amazon, Rakuten or Yahoo. So I have bought most of the furniture. I just have to wait for a few more things to arrive uh, next week. I also want to go to Nittery later today, which I will vlog in a different video. We need to buy a sofa, a katatsu, I also need to work on the Cafe Sheep room, which I might do later because right now it's kind of a storage with all of our suitcases. So once I've cleared that out, I want to buy a table, also a makeup table, a sewing machine. I also need to organize my closet, which I was planning to do a few days ago. I tried to do a Muji order and unfortunately they refuse to accept our credit card, even though it's a Japanese one. Um, yeah, there's just a lot to do and things are getting busy because next week, oh, I have cafes planned with Sophie. So we're going to the Pokemon Cafe, then the Harry Potter Cafe. Also, I've got some friends coming over from Australia. So I'm going to be taking them around for a bit. Also, I hired an assistant. Um, I maybe have mentioned this in previous videos. I can't remember. Just because my mind is a blur right now. I've got a Japanese assistant. Um, I don't know if she's going to be comfortable to be on camera or not. If she is, I will introduce her to you guys um, when we meet, uh, which is going to be next week. So yeah, I had Mel as an assistant when I was in Australia and she was really good. And I feel really bad about this because I hired her end of 2019 and we did one trip to Japan together. We were supposed to travel to Japan a lot in 2020. That was the original plan. Um, but you know, because of the pandemic, um, I canceled our trip that we were planning in March and then obviously lockdowns and everything. I was losing motivation on YouTube and yeah, I, I just kind of stopped uploading as well. So, but anyway, guys, I'm going to end this video here. Um, thank you so much for watching. I cannot wait 
to finally finish furnishing this apartment. Right now it's a mess, but um, I plan to really organize my life this year. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.